take this man to be your lawful wedded husband? I do. And you, which Rod Gentry, do you take this woman to be your lawful wedded wife? He does. I don't. I'll blow your heart out. All right, I'll take it. The ring, Brother Jen. The ring. The ring. Okay, use this one. Might big, maybe. Uh, but it'll do the trick. Uh, put it on a finger. Now say, with this ring, I thee wed. This ring, I thee wed. I now pronounce you man and wife. Now kiss the bride. I dogged if I will. Now look, son. This wedding might have been a little unexpected and all that, but you're just as married as you're ever going to be. Don't be afraid of minded about it. Now this girl is your wife, and I want you to take care of her. I do not want to see her a widow so soon. Now we'll all go back and have a drink to celebrate. Good. Guess we better get those gourd seeds planted right away. Is it that scurrilous being married to me? I'd as leave be tied to a cinnamon bear. Why'd you do it? Because. Because. That's a woman's answer for you. You know you lied. Who was it? Who was it ought to be shot? That mule brand Luke Radford, probably. That's it. It was Luke, wasn't it? No, Bushrod. It was you. Me? But you just fessed up to lying. Changed my mind. It was you, Bushrod. Stiff and sore and all pounded on. Meeting up with you was like declaring war on France or some other big country. You really going? Right now, alone. Your paw and those coyote brothers of yours can follow if they want. I'll guarantee you there'll be a string of dead churns from here to the territory. Go on and go. That's the kind of husband you turn out to be. I won't stop you. 